Hey, what's up, Sean? Not too much. It's Friday. It is Friday. Drinking a beer with my buddy. Yeah. What are we drinking? The streets. Mm. But did we review it? We did. All right. So second. check. But if you didn't already watch the video, go back and watch it. It's it's a great video. We make great videos. <laughs> <laughs> so, anyways, yes, we have we're, we we have, we have an unboxing, two unboxings to do. We we pre cut it. I we not, did not actually open. We pre cut because this was really kind of taped up pretty good. <laughs> yeah. Thanks, John. <laughs> um, but yeah, this is courtesy of our, of our buddy John um, from Fuji Foods. Apparently. Packing peanuts. Ooh, they're, I think these are the biodegradable ones too. Okay. Yeah, I'll let you dig into it. Well, I, I want to make this. I don't want to. Actually, let me do it because I have the barrel over here. Right. I'll pull these out and you can pull the. I should take the packing peanuts out first too. Well, this is legitimate. I'm legitimate unboxing here. I hope there's like one can in here. Oh, that'd be way funnier. All right. <laughs> so, Ooh. I'm going to pull out everything. You know, we'll just yeah. talk about it. All right, so it's three, you have two stars. Okay, cool. okay. So oh, we have just uh, three beers. It looks like two of the same. Ooh, yeah. Captain Jack from uh, the old Mecklenburg Brewery, uh, Pilsners. All right, there we go. Okay. These guys are really good. I haven't had I haven't had this, but but old old Mecklenburg is freaking awesome. All right. What's that one? Uh, this one here is Kolsch from Devil's Logic. Uh, I don't really know them. They're in Charlotte. Yep. Are you, are you familiar? I've heard of them, yep. Right. It says Community Kolsch. Uh, clean, crushable beers. Drink fresh or go to hell. Fair enough. <laughs> Thanks, John. Dude, this is awesome. Awesome. Yeah, the, I'm excited. Um, I'm a huge fan of Pilsner's. I'm a huge fan of Kolsch. Is my Kolsch yeah. is my favorite style of beer. Uh, when done right. So uh, I'm really excited because I, it's my jam. <laughs> Who said that 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 I'm sharing that with you though? I'm stronger than you. I'll take it home. Damn it. This is. I'm fatter than you. I'm sit on you. <laughs> you sit on me and just drink it in front of me. <laughs> and then for beer number one. Um, for the second box, this is courtesy of Matt over at Massive Beer Reviews. Um, if you haven't checked out Matt, who are we kidding? You've if, if you you're have. watching this, you've, you, you're you subscribed to Matt. Um, so what he's sending, I think there's two, there's probably, I think there's a couple of other things in there. Vengeful Heart from Kane. They're a blend of bourbon barrel aged um, American bar a blend of bourbon barrel aged and American what? Sean can't read. Blend of bourbon barrel aged and American barley wines. Oh, bourbon barrel aged barley wines and regular barley. Okay, that makes more sense. So what we're gonna do what we're gonna do here is <laughs> Sean can't read words. What we're gonna do here is um so he's going to send these to, I think, Kyle as well. And then I think he's going to get either get one for Keith or get together with Keith. And then the idea is we're going to do a, uh, a giant joint review. Oh, he, he scored. I think he said this is canned in like 2015. He scored a lower de bloom from 21st Amendment, their barley wine on a, on a just a shelf catching dust. So. This is going to be interesting. It looks like a can of Red Bull. <laughs> You've never had that beer? No. Ah, yeah. Okay. Because I would have seen that on the shelf and assumed it was Red Bull and avoided it. Yeah. Except two of them. Oh, Jesus. Two of each. Yeah, two of the. Okay, cool. So we can do these remotely if we want to. Are you shitting me? <laughs> Matt, you fucking gangster. <laughs> <laughs> See, all breweries should do this. Eight and a half. For a beer like that? Yeah, I agree. That's a single serving right there. It is. I, I haven't had this beer in a while. I, I remember really, really, really liking it back in the day, so I'm really excited for it. Um, but yeah, Barley Wine Central over here. Lager Central. Kosh. It's cold fermented, so we're kind of in the same territory. Yeah, it's, it's, it's lagerish. This is a pretty good kind of mashup right here. So, dude, John, thank you. Matt, thank you. Uh, oh, yeah. Be on the lookout for reviews of probably, yeah, I would say all of them. They're all relatively low ABV beers. <laughs> Mike's like, yes, <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Um, but yeah, guys, thanks again. And uh, let us know in the comments if any of you have, have had these, if you had an old, um, was it, yeah, lower lower de boom um, from 21st Amendment. And if you had any of the, let me put these backwards. Oh no, the same label on the same both sides. Already verified. Thanks. <laughs> You're so good to me. Um, <laughs> and if you've had uh, this, this, this uh, cane barley wine, vengeful heart, because that sounds ridiculous now that I know what it is. Jesus. Now that Mike had to read it. <laughs> 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 <laughs>
<laughs> but yeah, nerdsense.net, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, if those are your things, like, comment, subscribe, hit those notification bells so you're notified whenever we post new videos. I'm Sean. I'm Mike. And, and this, this is Nerdsense. Nerd